Hey man, it's Catch Pet Podcast. We back. Make sure you like, share, subscribe to the page. So today we're gonna be talking about Fat Joe speaking on the Trump sneakers. Yeah, you know I'm saying the Trump ones. And we'll be back. All right, yeah, man, we back. Make sure you like, share, subscribe to the page. Hit the thumbs up button if you like the content. Sketchpad is in the building. You know what it is. Make America great again. Got the hat right here. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Look, Donald Trump has released a sneaker. And um, Pat Joe's going to talk about why he got the sneaker and then we're going to talk about this because there's some stuff going around saying that black people don't like sneakers, which is far from the truth. I don't understand why we're even having this discussion. But look, let's go, man. Fat Joe. Just show him the box first, what it says. It's friends and family, there's only 50 of these. I got to get my hands on them. Once again, I'm not a Trumper. I dislike Trump. I'm not voting for him. Not now, not never. But I'm a sneaker collector into the art. So I had to find these. Now the mayor's going to call me. Everybody's going to call me. And say, you wilding out, Joe. Why you got the Trump? Look, mayor's the first one. Joe, you... I'm a sneaker collector. I don't know what none of these guys did. I collect sneakers. The rarer, the better. All right, man. So I got I got some thoughts on this. <clears throat> um, first of all, you don't have to announce that you're not voting for Donald Trump, Fat Joe. You don't have to validate why you brought the sneaker. You can buy sneakers. If you want to buy Donald Trump sneakers, just buy Donald Trump sneakers. If you're a sneaker collector, you don't have to explain to everybody why you brought the sneaker. And you know why he did that, though, right? Oh, I, I know why he did it. Mm-hmm. He don't want to be put in the same category as Meek Mill. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but you don't have to announce it. But the reason why you're doing this is be for, for validation. I was like, look, I'm a collector. I have to explain, but you didn't even have to tell people you brought the sneaker. No. You could have just kept that to yourself. Now now they're coming after you for buying the sneaker. And what is all this? The mainstream media telling us that black people don't like sneakers now? Because there was a news anchor who said Trump Releasing these sneakers will appeal to the black race because black people like sneakers. And they said that that was a racist comment. How is that a racist comment? The man said that black people like sneakers. Black people love sneakers. Because a white person says that black people like sneakers. That's a racist stereotypical comment. That's a fact. We love sneakers. Why is it such a big deal for a white person to say that black people like sneakers? Because black people always say that white people love tuna casserole. Does that make us racist? Because we think white people like tuna casseroles? Or we think white people like baked chicken all the time? Or Uggs? (laughs) We think he's racist. I don't understand that. Black people been wearing sneakers since sneakers first came out. All the sports athletes, 99% of them are black and they all have black sneakers. 
Michael Jordan, black man, the biggest sneaker ever in history. Outside of the ones, Jordan's is the most popular sneaker all over the world. So black people don't wear sneakers now. Now that's a racist comment now. Now we going too far now. Now you're just saying stuff just so you can literally say it. Now you're saying that black that a white person can't say that black people like sneakers. Because that's stereotypical. You can't spin that with me. There's no way in the world you can tell me that because a white man says that black people like sneakers, you're telling me. It's like it's like I don't know, people need to let this go. Because we all know black people like fried chicken. So if a white person says to me, you like fried chicken, I'm going to say, yeah, I do. Let's go get some fried chicken. But I'm not going to be out here saying, oh, well, it's racist because you asked me do I want some fried chicken. <laughs> I don't get it. People are too sensitive, and that's all I got to say about that. But go ahead, man. You got it. Yeah. Um, for one, you know, just to piggyback off of what you said, uh, Fat Joe didn't have to explain nothing. You know what I mean? If you wanted to buy the sneakers, buy the sneakers. You know what I mean? Who cares? It's not that big of a deal. You know, I, I, I don't like when, when the artist – feel like because they're in a certain space that they have to explain things to everybody you don't own no owe nobody any explanation it's a free country you could do whatever you want you know what i'm saying if you want to buy the trump sneakers buy the trump sneakers and then like you know what i mean you don't have to say anything else simple as that it's just you know you know what i mean uh i just didn't like that that was like I mean so brought the trump sneakers like you know i don't if i'm buying the trump sneakers i had to explain nobody why i brought or i brought the trumps oh i thought they were fire so i brought them you know what i mean and then the whole point of um of uh not voting and all this stuff it wasn't even necessary you know like it wasn't even that's what i haven't i it just it just didn't that part was just meaningful, meaningful, but wasn't meaningful at all. Like it just didn't make any sense to me. Like you don't have to tell nobody nothing. You know what I mean? You stand on, you stand ten toes down. I brought the Trump sneakers. That's it. Mm. Um. Um. As far as the uh, the black people not liking sneakers, I don't know where that narrative came from. That's some that's some weird stuff to me because. Uh, me, I got mad sneakers. Me, you know what I mean. I, I I'm a big sneaker head. You know, I I'm not so much as far as like getting rare types of sneakers. You know what I mean? Because I don't like trade sneakers or anything like that. But I like to buy certain types of sneakers to match with my outfits. So I'm a sneaker head. You know what I mean? I got a lot. Of, I got like four pairs of J's. I got uh, one pair of Air Force Ones. Like I I like sneakers. You know what I mean? So all that other stuff when they talking, I don't know, man. It's just people just run their mouth for no apparent reason. Like you know, you'll get you'll get one major outlet that 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 for to a certain extent has some credibility. So as soon as that major outlet says something, then everybody just gravitates to it and believes it because oh such and such said it. But just because such and such said it, don't mean that it's accurate. So. You know nah, I, mean? I, I agree with that. I agree with that. I just, I just think that we have became uh, this soft thing out here. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. it is what it is, man. But yeah, man. Fat Joe, man. I don't know what to say. But out here, see y'all. Peace, bye. That's right. Yeah.